It's been two weeks since I start looking for a stone house in Portugal. I rent a car and I'm traveling in Portugal to find a stone house under 10,000 euro. This time, I'm really excited. For the first time, I actually made an offer. We're gonna speak about the price, we're gonna speak about the documents, we're gonna go through everything, and hopefully, hopefully, we will close the deal very soon. Woo okay, I bought the ocean. So I'm going back to the fountain house. This time, I'm gonna meet the owner there. This is the house, this room, and then another floor down. I can tell there was a division of four. One, two, three, four. You can go with the ladder. Yeah, oh, yeah. This is really big stones and we are sitting on a big rock here. They cut your house into the stone. And there is a nice window here. And down here was to keep animals. Because it's a very small place, I want to make it livable as well. So, the belly and I see a kind of a crack following. The fountains which don't have any sign that you cannot drink, they are tested. They, they, they plug this in yeah. and then they fill up deposits. So it's not always running to the house? No, you need to have a deposit. It is from an offspring up there. It has okay. drinking water quality. I see the electricity is right here. Yeah. But there is any box going to the house? No. No. So actually I have just two ways of light and air, which is this one and this one. And the lower one doesn't even have the front. I felt very bad about that. He explained me this is some kind of community oven. Bread baking oven here. Yeah. Maybe uh, some kind of balcony so I can really enjoy the view. This is not quite what I expected. When, when you see the picture, I'll show you. It doesn't look like it's in front of the house. But if I want to bury a septic tank, it will be almost impossible yeah. here, no? Well, here it's difficult, no? But there, at the other house, it's possible. Where? The other house, I don't know, you never... You said you were interested in this house, so I'm not sure. This is, yeah, this is the house I saw and been published. The owner have another house in the village to show me. It cost 25,000 euros, way over my budget. So the bed used to be like a, like a cupboard. The lady who sold us the house, she was born in this house. Later, when she married, she built that house down there with her husband. And then they only kept goats in here. If you want to live down here, you need to um, to put the drain on the other side of the wall. Yeah, I can see water is coming from the mountain. Yeah. Okay. So let's go back to the fountain house. After seeing the fountain house, I fell in love with it. This is exactly the project I was looking for. I know there is a lot of things to do in the fountain house, but what can I say? I fell in love with that. So finally, I made an offer for the fountain house. And guess what? It was accepted. I've been waiting for that more than one year and a half. Smile on my way to Castello Banco. Oh, I need a beer or something. Uh, I've been waiting for that moment for so long. In Castello Banco, it's so good to have a bed after a few days in the car, my neck is not hurting. Taking a shower after all the reverse showers without so considering to stay another day, it's so good here. I like it here. I have to do some uh, work about my papers anyway for, for the NIF number and many things. So I think I will stay here to work. Uh, it's a great place. I'm paying only 12 euro here, including breakfast. I'm just gonna enjoy the city a little bit, show you guys some things. If you guys don't know, the NIF number is the tax number. You need this number to open a bank account, open a business, buy a house, whatever you want to do, which is uh, more than just travel, you need this NIF number. Unfortunately, 
I didn't do it before I came, but I'm working on it right now. I get the NIF number and I can uh, continue closing the deal. So I'll let you know. Hi Pablo, tell us about this place. I don't know very, very much. <laughs> <laughs> In my guest house, I find an amazing guy. He's from Maidera Island and he's walking the Camino Santiago. It's a walking trail going all the way from France to north of Spain. It's called Brinquinho. So when I decided to hike Portugal and do the Camino Santiago, I also wanted to say thank you to the islander. The idea is not to make fun of the outfits of my ancestors, is to, uh, to tell them thank you for having us here, right, basically. Welcome to my castle. This is why they call Castelo Branco, because of this castle. It's a beautiful wow. city. Waiting for the sunset. <laughs> He's going to call his editor, see if they can do a, uh, a live uh, show with me. But yeah, kind of cool. Winter your Portugal. It's been on TV. I've already gone on TV. Good, because then I'll be known along the way. <laughs> that was a good uh, welcome party. Castello Branco, the fruits are everywhere. Look at this prune tree. They are everywhere in the city and all you need to do is just grab one and enjoy. I just received some really good news. It's not just a dream, it's just around the corner. And I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna have a stone house in Portugal, a dream come true. So I'm gonna celebrate with some cappuccino. Moving on. I'm going to the city of Serta um, to discuss about the property I saw next to Guada. I get my NIF number soon and I can close this deal that I really want. My last night in the hostel here in Castelo Branco. I'm gonna sleep very good with a big smile. Proud of myself. Yes, I am. Everything is possible. Whatever dream you have, you can do it. Just be yourself and don't give a f Good luck. Celta. Celta is the city where I'm going to meet the owners of the fountain house. I still have two hours to spend until the meeting. So I'm just going around in small villages. Hopefully today we can sign the contract. We already agree about the price. A translator for me, it cost uh, 25 euro per hour. I hope it's not gonna take a lot of hours, but it's okay. I'm okay with this price. Hopefully I will find something interesting. And then I show you.